Scientists from Australia's Southern Cross University have come up with a technique called coral IVF to restore coral in damaged parts of the Great Barrier Reef. Researchers captured millions of coral larvae during mass spawning events that occur following the full moon in the months of November and December. These larvae were then co-cultured with an algae called zoanthellae, which was grown in a lab to have higher thermal tolerance. According to a news release from the university, these corals are now living in coral nursery rearer pools designed by the research team. Scientists say the rearer pools allow the baby coral to be turbocharged due to the algae, which increases their chance of survival. Optical sensors were added to track the progress of the baby coral. The team now has six rearer pools housing millions of coral larvae. These corals will be dispersed into damaged parts of the Great Barrier Reef to help them form new coral communities.